Hi, now this video will not be a tutorial. This video is for the subscribers and the people who follow these videos and probably want to know what's next because we are kind of in the middle of these tutorials, half, probably not half, but close to half of everything here in GIMP is covered. So right now it's about five hours and 10 minutes the duration of these tutorials so I'm guessing that around six hours more maybe seven and uh, I'll be done with that and um, even if it gets up to 12 hours I don't think that's all that much because in 12 hours you'll be able to go from a person who never even heard of this software to a person that knows everything all the options here all the tools and how to use them so it's that it's not that uh, long time basically if you watch an hour a day you'll be ready in two weeks so let's discuss what's next here I've covered the installing of GIMP the preferences the toolbox all the tools here some of the options in the menu and uh, the last video was about creating gradients two tutorials about that now the next thing will be about this display navigation here and then uh, about creating patterns that's going to be a long video too and then um, I think three videos about creating brushes because there's different uh, brushes that we can create here we can use a brush editor create a custom brush or animated brush and after that I'm going to jump to this menu here and cover all the options here some of which are very uh, really important these cover tools here some of the filters and of course here in the dockable dialogues we have some more dialogues that we can dock here they also will be discussed and after I cover everything the histogram here channels path everything I'll go to layers this will be the last tutorials will be ab about layers because the layers are the most uh, difficult and confusing thing to understand in a software like this when there's just a few layers it's not so intimidating but if you get like here in this image you see how many layers I have here and when you start adding alpha channels layer masks and all other options here and how different tools and options from the menus uh, relate to layers and you see that it can get very confusing that's why I will keep this for uh, dessert because when we go through these menus here and before when I was talking about the tools and some other options many times I have worked with layers here and I will work probably more with them going through through this menu here so when it comes to layers you will be practically pretty much familiar with them and then when I go in detail talking about layers to be easier to understand and to remember and to learn how to work with layers and don't have any problems with that so this is basically it how this tutorial course is going to go and um, Thank you for watching these videos, for subscribing, for all your comments, and uh, I appreciate all that, and bye for now.